bottles in the air Swallowed all my problems, now I just don't care And I'm up in the building till they throw me out of here Allow me to reintroduce myself Hello world I hope you miss me We're back again with another rendition of Mike Feeder Models and today we have the beautiful Mara Sade with us. She's here to tell us a little bit about her career, what she's done, what she's interested in doing so that hopefully you guys will be interested in working with her. So we are here in downtown Albuquerque today and I am a native New Mexican but not a native Albuquerquean or whatever the word is. I don't know what the proper term is. New Mexican. <laughs> yeah, I guess. But are you originally from Albuquerque or have yes. you... I am from Albuquerque. Um, I used to live on the east side for a little bit and then we moved to the west side and I've been there ever since. So. Cool. So this is your home, this is where you started and this is where you plan to stay for now? Uh, man, if I want to expand like a little bigger, I feel like I would have to move away just because New Mexico is amazing, especially when it comes to like the arts and everything, like modeling and everything. Um, but, you know, you gotta, I think. They were broader You're willing to expand yes. your horizons yeah. if the right yeah. opportunity came up. Yes. Cool. So I'm sure since you've been in Albuquerque since the beginning, you have a good network of people here that you've worked with and done projects with. Do you feel like you know a lot of people in the community here, or do you feel like you're kind of a newbie and you want to really branch out and get to know more Albuquerque? Um, I feel like in a good amount of time, a sh good short amount of time, I've gotten to know a lot of people. Um, quick so I, I'm in this little group on Facebook and that's how I, I got to see all the different models and all the photographers that I've worked with so that's predominantly where I get a lot of or that's how I met a lot of people through my face the Facebook cool so I think you touched on a good point that yeah it's kind of a big city but it's also we have like a very small tight-knit community here, yeah and you kind of get to know a lot of people and if you don't necessarily know them personally you've got to see their work or online. people know people who know them so it's kind of like it all intertwines it's a good it. it's a good networking yeah thing. it's good yes so in that same vein are there people that you've seen online that you necessarily haven't had the opportunity to work with in person but that you've wanted to is there like a bucket list yes geo rivers <laughs> work with him so sure. geo if you're watching <laughs> mara's waiting him um, all are... <laughs> there are other others but his mind pops right into mine but um I'm Malik Daniels. I wanted to work him. On I, my just, list. I just recently oh. worked with him. Yes, I was so excited. <laughs> Malik, we love you. <laughs> call us both. I mean, call her first because this is like her whole thing. But then I actually too. worked with him the other day. So ah, so you checked time. it off. It was cool. sweet. Yes. <laughs> what kind of work do you typically do? So um, I'm just dipping my toes in um, right now, just seeing what I, I'm good at and what I what can do or what strengths are and what I'm not good at. Um, I want to do a lot of fitness because that's what I'm about. I think you're. Thank you. Fit for the job. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> I'm nerd. Um, if you haven't noticed it, I don't, I don't fit the vibe I'm at all. I, like, I, if I don't I speak, forgot my glasses. Then I'll be okay. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah, I want to do a lot of fitness, basically. So a lot of photo, um, photo editorial um, type stuff that has to do with being fit. Peter or Gonzalez. Doing, I worked with him. Okay. Maybe. <laughs> um, like competitions too. I'd consider that modeling also. So. Yeah, definitely. Cool. So then I assume that you generally live a pretty fit lifestyle. What do you do to stay in shape? So I'm in the gym three to four times a week. Um, and I'm not going to say that I'm perfect at eating because I'm not. I'm not going to lie. Um, I say I'm like 80-20. I'm on the 80-20 diet. 80% like <laughs> is good and 20% is bad. Meaning weekends, I go all out. That's, <laughs> That's the perfect way to do it because if you restrict yourself too much, I've competed in fitness competitions and stuff myself and I've found that when you cut everything out, yes. then you get miserable yes. and you quit. Yes. So you have to find the balance, I think, for sure. I believe it. <laughs> so you've mentioned a couple times that you're just kind of dipping your toes into the whole thing. So I assume that you're a fairly new model. How long have you been doing it? Yeah, since September of last year. Okay. So, yeah, just started. What got you started? So, um, I've always wanted to be a model, like, since Tyra Banks, Tyra Show, <laughs> the next top model. Um, I was actually, I did this Barbizon type program where 
you know, they teach you a lot about manners and etiquette and modeling. Um, and I actually started off the very first time. Um, sorry. <laughs> can I look at the camera? You can yes, look at the camera. Okay. You're talking to them. <laughs> okay, good. Um, doing extra work. So my mom was watching the news and she saw that there was an audition in Santa Fe for a show called Hieroglyphs, like an Egyptian type show. Uh -huh. And I got hired on to be like a, a what is it, um, concubine. So that was a little risky for me, <laughs> just starting out. And so um, I started there and it was cool being behind the scenes and seeing cameras and like, it was amazing. So I, that kind of got me started a lot. And then just barely doing photography in September, which is a whole nother world too in itself because you gotta be aware of yourself. And, <laughs> well, it sounds like you jumped in full force, not you know, yeah. having no idea what you're getting yourself into, but not being scared to try new yeah. things, which is super cool. And so if anybody out there is looking for an adventurous girl to work with that's not scared to try whatever concept you might have, then it sounds like Mara might be the one for you guys to call. Me. All right. Well, I'm sure that at the end of this video, you will see all of her social media links. So go check her out. It sounds like there's a lot of opportunity for you to learn some things and maybe for you guys to get to work with somebody new. So check her out and until next time.